What's going on guys? Criminal Justice here and today we're back with another Police Academy LSP tutorial. Uh, I did have a request to uh, on how to install the canine dog into your LSP so that's what we're going to be doing today. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, go ahead and click the link in the description below. It's going to bring you to this page right here. It's going to be the German Shepherd um, Malinois canine dog uh, made by Martink. Uh, this is a, actually a very e easy installation guys. Now keep in mind uh, anything that you might need that you don't have for this tutorial, if you'll keep an eye in the right top corner of my screen, you will see links pop up. Those links that are popping up are links to my other videos on requirements that you may or may not need for this video. So, for example, you're going to have to have OpenIV for this video. If you don't have OpenIV, I will pop it up in the right top corner. At some point in this video, you'll see it pop up in a little black box. A uh, little back black rectangular box, and then it'll say install open IV here or something like that. But just keep it on the top right corner, guys. If there's stuff that you do not have for this that you need, it will be in the video. Okay. If it's not, comment down below. Let me know you don't have it, and I'll link you to the video. Uh, with that being said, guys and girls, let's go ahead and click download the file here. And we want the, um, I will show you guys this. Anytime you're unsure of the version, all you have to do is look here 101. So if you click download the file, you're going to want the um one right here this is updated uh 101 that's the one you want to download that and put this somewhere where you know how to get to it ladies and gentlemen um as a matter of fact i need to go ahead and download it myself let me go ahead and download it so you download it right there and it's going to download right over here <clears throat> hope you guys are having a great week so far i hope you are having one of you in life and that you want to consist of prayer with god or some kind of meditation as it is always good to do that it's always good to stay in meditation and prayer or you know, just just practice whatever you believe. It's it's just always good to do that. Uh, so let's let this download. I do have another game uh, downloading right now, so it might affect my download time here just a tad bit. I'm actually installing my Far Cry 6 right now. I'm in the process of downloading all, uh, installing all my other games uh, to this new PC. So I have a lot of games, guys, from Origins, uh, Epic, Steam, uh, Ubisoft. All right, so now that you got that, guys, you can just click this little folder right here. It'll take you right to the downloads folder, and we can close out of our browser. And you're just going to grab this right here, and you're going to pull it out to your desktop like so. Close out of this. And make sure that whatever directory you're modding, uh, that that's the, the directory you want to mod, okay? Uh, for example, this is the directory that I'm modding right here. Um, and I'll have to put this in course the rest of my files as well because I forgot to install my canine dog. Uh, but just make sure that you have the directory open that you want to mod. You don't have to have it open. Just make sure that um, it's the one that's available to play. So it needs to look... The one you're modding needs to say Grand Theft Auto 5. Not copy, not this, not that. It needs to say Grand Theft Auto 5, okay? So make sure that's open and available. Uh, close that. And then you want to open up OpenIV, ladies and gentlemen. Click on Windows for Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, if you do not have OpenIV, like I said a while ago, I will link in the top right corner, taking you to a video showing you how to install OpenIV and how to get all your patch days as well because you're going to need all your patch days installed for this video. Now, once you are in OpenIV, guys, first and foremost, make sure you are in edit mode, okay? That edit mode needs to be highlighted in blue. It needs to be in blue. Now, if you want to be in edit mode at all times, uh, go over here to Tools, go to Options, Go to your general tab, and if this default work mode right here says read only, then change this from read only to edit, just like so. Okay, just like that, then click close. And now every time you open up open IV, you will now be in edit mode. Now with that out of the way, let's open up our, our K9 WinRAR, and let's open up the README, okay? And right here is going to give you your pathway on where you need to go, all right? So just follow this pathway right here in your open IV. So what do we want? We want to go to mods and then we want time 64 E. Now, as you guys can see, I have it right here, but if you do not have it in this part of your open IV, if you'll go down the side column right about here and click on it right there. Okay. You will then see a red banner pop up right here. that says either copy to mods folder or show in mods folder. Okay. So go ahead and click either copy or show in mods folder, whichever one it says, just click it. And then the next one we're going to want, what's the next one say? It says, um, it says models. So models, CD images, right? And then the last one we want is streamed pads underscore a underscore underscore uh, C uh, dot RPF. Now the easiest way to do this, if you have a hard time finding it over here, 
is just highlight it right here in your readme not the not the lines but the the the, the word itself the stream pets underscore a underscore c dot rpf highlight it right click click copy then go up here to your open iv search tab click in there and hit left control v v is in victor it'll pull up right there double click it now when you double click it if you put that in the in the uh, search tab you're going to have to clear it out because you're going to get this right here so make sure you clear your search tab once you do that okay clear it out once you clear it you'll see all this now we are in the right area here's your shepherd here's your husky uh there's chop right there um so what we want to do is close out of this readme now because we got the, we got the correct pathway and we want to highlight everything in this winrar and hold down the control key and deselect the readme and credits text you do not need those you just need those three files the shepherd uh the shepherd yft and the shepherd ymt you're going to grab these three files Pull them into your open IV, all right, and you're going to drop them in. Now, in order to see if that took, which which I know it did, you want to go right here to your open IV and go to that AC Shepherd folder, open it up, and you can double click on the head triple zero R Y D D, and this will show your canine dog right there. He is. Well, that is that is extremely, extremely detailed. <laughs> Oh, gosh. But that's how you know that, <laughs> that your dog is in there. Uh, if you go, like, say, here, this is going to show the upper part of his vest. And then if you go, say, somewhere, like, to accessories, this will show the side of the vest. Uh, anyway, with that being said, guys, uh, we can go back to our open IV, click close, uh, click, click file, and close all archives. Close out your open IV. Close out of that. Get rid of that shortcut. And I'm going to take you guys to the game and show you this dog and uh, what it looks like. So let's go inside the game. I'll see you inside of LSPFR. Howdy, partners. So when you get into the game, this is how we're going to do this. All right, this is how it's going to go. Now, you're going to need a little thing called Ultimate Backup. If you ain't got it, like CJ said, look in the right top corner. You'll see the link pop up. And that will lead you to another one of his videos showing you how to install Ultimate Backup. You got to have awesome backup in order to spawn your canine. You should know that by now. If you don't know that, you need to study a little bit more of LSP4 before you watch the advanced tutorial. You got it? All right, then. Let's go ahead and let's pull up our awesome backup here. Look in the top right corner. You'll see that link drop any time or it might have already dropped. If it didn't, you didn't. If it did, you didn't see it. You should have been paying attention just playing this day. All right. Hit you, you and your keyboard. Pull up y'all the backup. If you watch the video, you should know how to pull it up by now. We're going to go over to our canine partner, okay? Again, if you watched the video on how to install the backup, you should know how to get your canine partner by now, all right? Now, let's go ahead and spawn our canine partner. <clears throat> Excuse me, fellas. You're going to see right there, there's your little doggy right there. That's Rusty. That's my boy, Rusty. Come on, Rusty. You ready to get in the vehicle? Go on, get in, man. Get in before I kick in the ribs, man. Get in the car. Now, that's your canine dog right there. That's what he looks like. Ain't much else to it, ladies and gentlemen. Subscribe to CJ's channel if you haven't already. And smash that like button for him, alright? And we'll see you on the next video. Sergeant Billy Bob is out. Whee!